Okay, so let's have a look to this system. Um, once uh, the payload of the fuel are set, so we have already the perfect in it, so we see the full is done, the payload is set. So now we can open the application, it is called Takeoff Performance System, anyone? This one is very simple. So, this is the page, okay, yes, that's application. That page is the page that you push next in takeoff. So you can open the applications, get data from SIM, set the runway, set the flaps, set automatic trust. The anti ice in this case are off. It will take care of the length of the runway, temperature, all these factors, okay? And uh, weather as well. So we're gonna put the slope. It's 0 0.3, the slope for that runway, you see? And then we put the uh, actual wind in this page. I don't know how important it is, but do it. Plus, you can select the type of uh, runway, the condition, runway conditions, skid, wet, dry. Let's leave it dry. So, go back to the perfect in it. So, now we go to N1 limit. And with the compute all this information to know which kind of... In wet, icy, and snow condition, you cannot apply the rated. So anytime you choose this kind of condition automatically or you select it you, and you compute, you will have prohibited the rated. So now we are dry, so we can do it. And we have departure to 22K and assume temperature of 39 degrees. So we go select U2, select input the temperature, 39, assume temperature, Select uh, automatically, we get the option um, to the take off and the rest carry on as usual. Um, I think it's good, it's nice. The, the, the tops is uh, very simple, the top cut is much better. 